WTAJ Sports with Jack Washer. Well, there's a guy at every Penn State game you just cannot miss. He loud, he's loud, and he gets the people going. And he's pulled off a comeback that deserves its own show, not just an intro. Peter Tertra with more. When you get into the game, chances are you'll hear it. Then you'll see it. Eric Gaspitch is the mic man with all the moves. A student who's um, confident, who has outstanding speaking skills, who um, has a lot of energy, obviously, because he's going to be performing in front of over 100,000 people. To get him on the microphone saying, are you ready for Penn State football? A loud mouth with a bigger heart. I'm being very genuine in saying this. I will do anything to make somebody happy or make their day. Here's what you don't know. His story starts way before he even picked up a mic. I was playing soccer at the age of 10. I was in a rec league, and um, I got tackled by a player on the opposing team. This was not a scraped knee. This was serious. Gas Pitch had a traumatic brain injury. With a lot of damage to the frontal lobe and the occipital lobe. So front and back, so the brain had bounced back and forth. I couldn't read, I couldn't write, I couldn't do math. I, I, I was able to see letters and identify what a letter was, but I couldn't put it together into a word. He would have to work for years to get back on track, relearning how to do everyday things, having problems with memory, and especially noise. I hear it negative decibels and loud noises to you are extremely loud to me. My father one day was wrapping a sub, like a sandwich in tin foil, aluminum foil, and the sound of the aluminum foil was enough that I, I had to walk away from the situation. Now if that sound was enough to make you uncomfortable, imagine being in this stadium with more than 100,000 people loud and proud. During my freshman year, I didn't even have student tickets to the football games because it was still too loud for me to be able to handle it. During my sophomore year, I decided that I was going to be a Nittanyville student and I was going to be in Nittanyville every week that I could. Even if I had to put headphones on, I was going to be in that stadium because I'm a Penn State fan, live and die, and that's what I was going to do. When he had the chance to try out, well, you know the rest. Are you ready for Penn State? I'm considered their miracle patient, so I wasn't supposed to be even able to finish high school in their eyes. Eric Gaspitch is the mic man, and he is so much more. Peter Terpstra, Fort Indy Nation.